Hey everybody, I'm Amy. I'm Dan. We are the Hustle Couple coming at you today with what's sold on eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari. Yes! Finally. Hope everybody had a great weekend. Welcome back. It's Hi. Monday. Whoo! It's Monday mm -hmm. and it's Good. not a hundred degrees outside. Hi, if you're new here, welcome. We're so happy to have you. Hey, how's everybody doing? We do this every single weekday for the most part. Sometimes mm -hmm. we throw in a little extra. Yeah, like and a thrift haul sometimes. Sometimes. You know? And uh, we show you show you what is selling right now. So it's really beneficial if you subscribe and you turn on the bell notification so that you know to watch each video every single day. Uh, we don't really do a lot of self-promotion like that, but I figure I might. As well, it's Monday. Sure, right? Happy self promotion Monday. Everybody. If you're having slow sales, you'll be like, "Well, they sold that. Maybe I could sell that." <laughs> okay, right? All right. Three things on Macari. I'm gonna do my best to show you. Three. I mean, yeah, no, two things on Macari. Two. Oh, this was not Macari. This was Poshmark. Okay, got it. two things on Macari. I'm gonna show you the listing so that you can understand what the item is a little bit better. And I'm going to tell you how long things have been listed and what we paid for them. We're going to try to we're going to we're try to cover all co the everything. We're trying to be best and do all the things. Okay, first up. I love these pants, but they sure did take a long time to sell. We're oh sure lord, you didn't get me set up here. You know I'm oh. blind. Blinded. Oh no, 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 no! Not no. within the first. No, 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 no. <laughs> I keep getting copyright strikes. I'm just. Just sound like their record. I know, right? What happens? Uncanny. All right. So um, I'll just go backwards. It's fine. That's fine. Okay. Okay. This is, but you have the right thing. I have the right thing. Yes. These were ninety nine cents. These are so J these Crew are the Factory Green Novelty Goldfish Capri Pants, women size eight, and I have the style number in the EUC in the title. Mm. I don't do any of that anymore. No, you don't. So I don't put the style number in the title it's irrelevant for most people euc i do not use any we call this acronyms yeah like that Re anymore reseller jargon i don't do that I do that and uh i actually don't even put j crew factory in the title anymore i just put j crew i'm not really i do put it in the brand but not in the title uh these are cool though they're novelty print goldfish pants right Love and a novelty print. I love a novel, especially an embroidered. I thought these would go really fast. They look like a little goldfish on them. <laughs> they did not go very fast, though. We have had them listed. This is number 3821, which we use a numerical system. So that's in the 3000s. We're now in the 10,000s. 10,000. So those have probably been listed since 2021. Yeah. So maybe that's not the best pickup we ever did. Maybe not. Okay. All right, so this is shipping ground advantage through Mercari. Oh, so it's under FedEx? Nope. Oh, it's under ground advantage. So it's just going in a regular poly mail. I gotcha. I gotcha. Okay. The next thing to sell on Mercari is this Free People top. I think you're going to love it. It's a peasant top. I'm going to show you what that means. And just one minute, presto, change, oh, boom. Hey, there you go. It's a little. This is the Free People Size Large Top Talk About It Tunic Blouse Tiered Ditzy Floral Peasant. Okay, let me tell you what all this means. Well, you said a lot of words there. Yeah, and I would also maybe say square neck. That's the neckline here, square neck. A peasant top looks kind of like this. It's, it's got like a little bit of lacy loose and fluttery flues. <laughs> <laughs> uh, a ditzy floral is a very tiny flower print that's multiplied a lot of times. Uh, I use Google Lens which is on your Google app on your phone. You can use it to take a picture of the item. And it almost always with three people will come up and tell you what it is, the name of the uh, item. And then I try to include that in the title. Great. So this sold, the J. Crew pants sold for 18 and this free people sold for $27. We paid three forty nine for it. I would like you to know that that free people top had more interest than anything I've listed free people in a very long time. Okay. It is a size large, but I have a lot of size larges listed that didn't get that much attention. So something about that, mm -hmm. it was only listed about a week, and it had likes on eBay, on Poshmark, and Mercari. 
Okay. So I, I just want to point those out because the next one is similar to that in that there was a ton of activity on this listing. All right. Doesn't mean it's going to sell for a ton, but it means it's in demand. You know what I mean? So Maybe. we're moving on to Poshmark, right? We are going to move on to Poshmark. Okay. This had so much interest on all of the platforms. Yes. This is soft surroundings, women's size, extra large, boho broomstick, skirt, teal, cotton lining, sequins. Uh, our soft surroundings normally doesn't get this kind of attention. So I just want to show you. This is a broomstick skirt. It's a, a long maxi. Sometimes it's lined, but it has these tiers that go down it. And that's what kind of makes us. These were very insanely popular in the 90s. So the 90s are back, and if you include the word broomstick, when you list skirts like this, they will sell faster, in my opinion. Here is the soft surroundings tag, and it's number 9946. So it was listed a couple of weeks before. Uh, look at all these likes. Don't just take my word for it. It has 12 likes on it, on Poshmark. I sent out offers on this for eBay for a lot. So it did go for $25, and I find that when something is really popular like that and nobody buys it, it's priced too high. So I start kind of aggressively offering lower and lower and lower each time to figure out what the market value is. And now I know. <laughs> 25 dollars. 25 bucks. That's what it's worth. So this was also 349 cost of goods. And since it's Poshmark, we can use any priority mail shipping packaging we want. Most of the clothes always goes in Tyvex. This is not correct. What am I doing? Why is this not correct? Um, what's happening? I have to go backwards for some reason. No. What is this? I don't. Yeah, it's backwards. Oh, it's backwards. Okay. That's what I just said. I don't know why it's backwards. I don't know why it's backwards either. Okay, is are you good? Are you? Am I good? I don't the, know. The first one was good. I checked the. <laughs> Some reason yeah, our. Yeah, we're good. Oh yeah, we're on the LA Tahari now. Okay, for, for but now I reason. have to find it because it's backwards. Because it's backwards. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be that one. All right. All right. Got it. I got, got it. it, guys. Whew. Got it. This is a brand called Ellie <laughs> Tahari. We sell a lot of it, but it doesn't go for that much. So I just want to make it really clear. This is Ellie Tahari size large silk ruffle front, front blouse sleeveless stretch jewel tones. I did just list this pretty recently, maybe in the last couple of weeks. This stuff, the Ellie Tahari, don't get it confused by T with Tahari or Tahari. The Ellie Tahari is the top of the line in this brand. It is very nice. The retail on it is incredibly high. Uh, we took a picture of this on the dress form. And uh, it's a really, really nice piece. What do we pay for it? $3.59. Okay, $3.59. This is a watercolor print. Kind of looks like all smudgy and abstract-like. Hopefully that's helpful for you. So this Ellie Tahari sold for $24 on Poshmark. I think that's great. But like retail, it was probably $200. Yeah. It's a really, really high... High dollar retail brand. Y'all, I'm trying to see with my eyes that don't work anymore. Okay, I love this sweater. This also got a lot of attention. This is an anthropology brand. I did not know that when I picked it up. I knew that from doing comps. And this is a sweater, so fall stuff is moving. This is the anthropology if it were me size medium green sweater buttons down the back oversized oh fun times whenever there's something on the back we try to <laughs> sleeves. this is why we got a mannequin uh, uh that's we, the creepy arms one creepy arms mannequin we do uh we call this the front seat back seat method uh -huh, that's and patented by the way we use photo room <laughs> to put the front and the back so you can kind of get an idea of what you're buying this did Gosh, this creepy mannequin with the creepy hands. I know. We have a much better mannequin now, which is, thank goodness. This is the tag, if it were me. So this is from the bins. Uh, and 
it sold for $30. All right. And it's pretty exciting to find things with buttons down the back because I follow many stylists on Instagram, and that's a hot tip. Hot tip! Find some stylists to follow, and you can just Google like celebrity stylists because they have awesome Instagram where they recommend things to purchase because they get money from the affiliate links. Dan is having a time over here. And they're influencers. Nice. So they tell people what to buy. Yeah. And this brand called Doen, which a lot of them recommend, has a lot of cardigans that are reversible. And the buttons, if they're reversible, you can wear them down the back. Uh -huh. And so these stylists love to style people with buttons down the back. So I'm always looking for that in other brands because Doan is expensive on the resale market. But people that watch those stylists, a lot of people do, okay? If you're a clothing reseller, I'm telling you, get in the game. Then they're like, oh, I want a sweater with buttons on the back. And they search for it. And I'm like, I got you for $30 instead of $130 or $230. Right. Okay. There's your hot tip for today. That's all I got for you. It's a good one. It's a good one. Backwards. No, you were correct. The number isn't correct, though. Wait, I gotta fix it. I need a pen. Okay, hold on. Okay. My life is crumbling. Oh, Before no. Guys. Okay. Okay. 9189. Something happened with the number on this. I just, I will never know what happened. Okay, you need a different background. Yes, I do. All right, all right, all right. Here you go. Thank you. There you go. These are Lafayette 148 women's shorts, Bermuda shorts. Happy to get these sold before the end of the season. God, I cannot see anything. There you go. Those are them. Uh, Lafayette 148 women's size 12 Bermuda shorts, white stretch cotton, 14 inch inseam. I always put the inseam for Bermuda shorts in the title if I can fit it. I don't use punctuation in the title unless it's in the last like quarter of the title. So 14, I use the symbol for inches, which is a quote. <laughs> and uh, ah! okay. <laughs> So these sold for $25, and this is the third pair of these that we have sold, which leads me to believe that this is a really good thing to pick up right now. This is the, the label. This is not a brand new, by any means, Lafayette title. I mean, label. <laughs> I'm trying. To... You're doing your best. Doing my Monday. Best. Monday. Okay. Next. I don't know where these pants came from. I don't know what they are. I don't know the brand. <laughs> so they've been listed a while. It's 7373 is the number. Yeah, those are so old. So someone offered 11 bucks, and I was like, I let's go. Let's make this deal. Right? Let's make it happen. Get them out of here. And so I did. Also, they were basic. They're not bad. I just didn't know what they were. These are tribal women's size 12 dress pants, black flat front stretch, comfort front pocket. I have the word front twice here. That's a no-no. This is me going too fast. If I were to relist these, I'd be like, ah. I try not to ever duplicate words in my title. And these are dress pants. I mean, I don't know. So somebody offered 11. I said, let's let's do this. <laughs> I will show you the brand. Though. And, you know, I think we've sold tribal and tops. I think we have. So I don't think it's a bad brand. But look how it's all sewn on. It's like, huh? Oh, no, it's not on there. But I, I really don't think this is a bad brand. It, it actually has a nice looking tag. So maybe look it up before you. This is something we got in an estate sale, so we didn't really have a choice in the matter. You know what I mean? I do know what you mean. You know what I mean, Vern? Vern. So <laughs> <Yeah, laughs> <it was> coming. <laughs> All right. Okay. Next. Okay. All right. Red is so on trend, and I know this again from my stylist that's the word you're looking for blogger favorites and stuff i know people talk about that all the time no 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 no, no, no. that's too much just go to the stylist directly because they style all the bloggers you can do this i'm telling you just go to the cut store up, just cut out the middle man <laughs> all right these are talbots but they're red and red pants and red tops are doing really well for us right now talbots women's size 20 high waist straight leg corduroy stretch pants red the color on these is not great. I'm going to admit that right now. Yeah. They sold for $17. I think we could have gotten more for these if the pictures were better. Here's the Talbots. 
But corduroy selling, so that's telling us fall is upon us, friends. At least fall shopping. That's what I mean. Yep. So corduroy is a very fall esque thing. And the next thing is like a giveaway. I don't know what happened. Are you giving it, stuff away? I keep giving it away. <laughs> I can't help it. I don't know. If you guys leave, if we get 100 comments, I'll leave my stylist Instagrams in the comments. Hello. Can we get to 100? Just one person, just leave 100. No, <laughs> don't do it. JB, do not do it. If Heads we get a hundred unique comments, I will link all my favorite stylists. Well, I'll have Dan do it in the description so you don't have to go find them. I'm telling you, you're going to be so glad you clicked on this video today because I've been holding that one in for a long time. Yeah, you have. I mean, like, since we I started. don't even know about this. I know. Y'all, this is like a big secret. We need to get some engagement going on because since the Java sock days, <laughs> our engagement's been down a little bit. So let's just get on in there. This is for everybody that sells clothing. It will help you. All right. This is a Lafayette 148 pencil skirt. We have a frenzy backseat of this because it has an exposed zipper. I think it goes all the way down the back. Like someone could just like come shank you. Yeah. Right? <laughs> like you're walking through the airport. <laughs> yeah. You thought you had a skirt on. Right? Uh-oh. <laughs> Some toddler comes up like behind you in line and shoop. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Anyway, this is new tags. Y'all, it sold for $21. I would expect to get way more for this new tags yeah. from Lafayette. Look at that retail. What's that say? $198. Good lord. This is a den. Yeah, it goes all the way down, girl. <laughs> Caution. Caution. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> So I had this pair of pants that were, let me tell you about this. Anyway, $21 denim skirt. Okay. All right. So I had the Adidas pants in middle school with the snaps all the Snap way down. Snap pants. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Luckily in middle school, I used to wear, what do you call them? Like bike shorts all the time. Everybody wore bike shorts. Okay. So I had them on. Yeah. Because this dude grabbed the side of my pants <laughs> to like pull me. He didn't, he didn't do it to take my pants off. Okay. Right. He was like, hey, Amy, grab like you would on a belt loop. <laughs> So he goes in and the other side goes out and I'm like ah! <laughs> in middle school I was mortified. This man pulled uh, off my entire pants. Nice. Never wore them again. <laughs> Never again. His name was Patrick. I remember to this very day. What the heck, Patrick? What you doing? He pulled my pants off. All right. We're gonna move on to the bay. The bay, starting off with a good one too. Yes. We had some absolute bangers and then some pingers. A pinger is something that you thought would sell for more, but didn't. Right. We got we got all kinds today. We're equal opportunity here <laughs> at the Hustle HQ. Yeah. All right. First one is menswear. Yeah. I have been telling y'all. This stuff is going to start flying because of suits. We're up to 18 billion views in the last 30 days. <laughs> I think that's what it was. What did I tell you? 18 billion? Yeah, it was like minutes, though. It was something really weird. Whatever. Minutes. A lot. A freaking lot. People are watching the show Suits. We are, we are those people. <laughs> Us included. And the clothing is amazing, and I just think it's going to shift the tide. We were like all athleisure all the time, and I just think this is going to shift the tide. So this is a Heart Schaffner Marks HSM is also in the title. Excuse me while I so turn this nice. on. It is very nice. This is a great piece, and I'm happy that I can show you the label. Heart Schaffner Marks HSM 43 regular Laurel Piana 100% cashmere black sport coat brand new. Oh, good. I pulled that already. Let me go back and do it. Um... This thing is nice. It's really nice. HSM is a mid mid tier, I would say, but a very popular brand. I'll show you the tag. Like here's the Laura Piana, meaning the fabric is Laura Piana. Right. This did not get made by Laura Piana. It got made by Hart Schaffner Marks. This is one of their logos. Mm hmm. It's that one's a little newer. There's a, I mean, a newer one now. Yeah. It's a more recent logo. Yes. And um, 
if you're looking to get into this did sell for $119, which is an absolute steal. It is for 100% Laura Pion cashmere. Laura Piana is known for their cashmere. Yeah. Worldwide, like the best cashmere in the world comes from Laura Piana. This is, I can't even imagine how much this was. Retail? Yeah. 800 bucks. So, but if it were made by Laura Piana? $8,000? Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> uh, so they lend out fabric, sell fabric to suppliers. They're, yeah, they're a fabric mill. Uh, yeah. We paid three ninety nine for this. Sweet. Uh, it sold for one nineteen ninety six. Okay, what is the? Give me the info here. Uh, weight comes first. We have it at three pounds, but it's at only two, so that's good. And it's eleven by three by thirteen. Okay. And did you want to check it? Because it's only going to Mississippi. Are we good? Priority mail seven dollars twenty cents. Perfect. Okay. What I want to tell you is if you're trying to get into the menswear game, this is how we recommend doing it. Another hot tip. Hot tip. Oh my God, you guys are getting, this is like the best video. It's because I'm wearing this Mama Cass situation. Right? I'm living out my 1969 Woodstock. Yeah. I really think that's when I was born in another life. Okay. I mean, when, I, not born. Not born. I definitely participated in the Woodstocks. <laughs> I would recommend going, if you're trying to get into menswear, just going to the sport coat section. Before you do the polos and the dress shirt, don't do that. If you're just getting started, go into the sport coats and you're looking for the brands that we tell you about. There's like five of them. Main brands. Mm -hmm. Tell just off the Surefire. Uh, what, light, Italian ones. Canali, Xenia, Brooks Brothers, higher end ones. Um, J. Crew, Ludlow's. Um, HSM. Hugo, Hugo Boss, HSM, Hickey Freeman. Hickey Freeman. Yeah. Chitin, Brioni. <sighs> Yeah, I mean, those are but I'm saying, yeah, just get in your mind here. Yeah. Then we have a video called "How to Measure Everything," and I'm telling you, you can measure these four coats. It's not in, it's not insanely hard to do. It's no, very you can, easy. You can do it. Put them on a thing. Take a picture of them. Put all the measurements in it, and you will sell them. It might if, take a little bit of time. But there right. Go. But if you're trying to dabble, this yeah. is where you should start because you can turn like most people's four coats are like ten bucks. Yeah. Ours are a little cheaper. Yeah. <coughs> you could turn it to over 100. Yeah, for sure. You can do it. Okay. Okay. I keep having to cough on them. Oh, no. Next. I listed this last night and it sold immediately. I needed to do a disclaimer here. Okay. I only know about one of these sales on eBay that's going to a viewer. I don't know about anything else. So when I tell you I've never sold a brand before and it sold immediately, that doesn't mean go out and buy it because it could have been a viewer sale. <laughs> I, no, it's true. It it's true. comes with the territory. Sure. <clears throat> so I was not sure this was going to sell because I've never sold this brand before, but I have sure seen it a lot. But what I'm about to say, take with a grain of salt until I have other data to back it up. Okay. Okay. This is Peck and Peck, and I'm sure you've seen it before. Women's size large, reptile print, top stretch, three-quarter sleeve blouse. I listed this yesterday, and it sold on the on-sale price for $23.96. Um, it's just a stretchy top. It does have some bedazzling on it, but I'm sure you've seen this brand before. Look at the tag. I'm sure you've seen it. I see it at the thrift store all the time. Have you seen this before? Yes. Yes. Just because this top sold... Either it, A, could have gone to a viewer, B, it could have sold because it was reptile, maybe that's in, I don't know, or C, it might just be an in-demand item. I, I don't have answers for you right now, I just wanted to tell you what I know. Okay. And I'm that's very fair. happy that that's it sold fair. fast. Right. I'm not going to give that disclaimer for everything. I'm, that's a blanket disclaimer today, okay? Then. I just feel like in the, you know, spirit of being as transparent as possible. Sure. Okay. All the right. next thing had a ton of interest on it too. And this I listed yesterday or the day before. It nice. sold very fast. Also didn't know the brand. So this tells me that it's either A, a viewer, or B, style. the style. Because we sold another broomstick. Skip, mm -hmm. Sticks. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> Excuse me. My record was skipping. <laughs> <laughs> 
it has a drawstring waist. This is from the brand Silver Stream Women's One Size Broomstick Maxi Skirt Blue Tiered Elastic Waist. Go, go to the store and get yourselves a maxi skirt. It, these tiered. This one really shows the tiers pretty clearly. Yeah. It has fringe at the bottom. It is vintage. That's what VTG means at the end. When I can't fit the full word, I put VTG. Um, here's the, you could tell from the label, it's very vintage. None of the platforms had Silver Stream as a known brand. So I really wasn't sure it would sell at all, which tells me this was probably style. There you go. You feel? I feel. Okay. Um, let me write this down. I just got to get caught up here. Oh, you're all good. We've had this for 72 years. <laughs> I mean, I literally since oh, 2020. Oh, man. Yep. This is a bathing suit. I have a stock photo here. I keep saying that I don't use stock photos anymore, and I really don't. Um, it's from J. Crew. J. Crew Fireworks High Waist Bikini, two piece swimsuit, size extra small, red, blue print, and this sold for $20. I've had this price all over the map. You guys, it's still got a, a paper. <laughs> Our little paper tag. Here's the J. Crew. We have it. See, we've, we've used all different types of mannequins. This is one of those plastic half forms that hangs on a hook. It works really well. Yeah. We've got them for 10 bucks. Okay. Anyway. So happy to see that get out of here right in, you know, at the end of summer. That's great. This is going to a freight forwarder. I would like to mention something about this. Sure. We get questions a lot whether is that's not a bad thing. Do you work? We don't worry about that at all. I don't care how somebody's getting something. Yeah. Especially a twenty dollar bathing suit. You can tell it's going to a freight forwarder because normally it's like got all these weird codes on it and they'll tell you not to include a we call it invoice. Yeah. Um this one's going it normally it's some kind of airport way situation. This is that. And it's fine. All right. And it's usually on a port city too. Yeah. Next, you will not be surprised. I'm here to show you some more Chico's pants. What? You're kidding. These are the Chico's women's size 1.5 US 10 pull-on dress pants, black, so slimming, stretch cotton. And these are what they look like. They're just black pull-on pants. They mm -hmm. feel like Eileen Fisher pants a little bit. So that cost of goods was three bucks on these. They're a 1.5 short. I'm not sure I listed these correctly. I gotta look at my specifics. Sometimes for short, I put it in the petite category. We just listed these. I may have done a boo boo here. Can you see? Can you see anything? Uh, it says size type regular fit classic. Mm. Mm. We'll see. We'll see what happens. <laughs> okay. I'm not. I'm not 100 sure if they saw the photos or not. This is what happens when I go fast, just being honest. That's all right. Mistakes happen sometimes. I didn't even notice it until I like, zoomed in because the short is underneath of it. Yeah. All right. This one's going international. So a lot of our people on our lives tell us that um, they don't sell Chico's in other countries. And so maybe that's why it's going international. Oh, this one right nope i think yes i couldn't see the stripes on my my picture's like this big <laughs> all right this is a chico's women's size three us 16 extra large tunic top striped black white stretch three-quarter sleeve i could have called this a breton shirt but it does not have the boat neck and the sleeves i can't describe the breton shirt has more white than black <laughs> <laughs> You're going to be like, Amy, what are you talking about? Okay. There's a very specific look, and this isn't quite it. This is just a black and white shirt. <laughs> I can't explain it. I don't know. Anyway, here's the pictures. Uh, this sold for $23.96. 
Okay, we've got three dollars seventeen cents into that guy. And there's the tag. Um, okay, wait, what am I doing? Hold on. What is this? Oh, this is this. Hold That's on. Good. I am overworked and underpaid at this job right now. I'm trying to do all this managing. Okay, I have an idea. Okay, what's that? While I'm doing this, you do, I this. Can do this. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. split the workload. Totally. Love it. Okay. Oh, you never ask. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Oh, you guys are gonna love this one. This is another Chico's. I know. Is it Chico's or Topics? It's, it's Chico's. It's Chico's. Um, but this is what we've been telling you all along. So this is great. It fits what we say. And oh, but then I can't read the title. I can try to read it off here. Oh gosh. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, I can't. <laughs> y'all, I have glasses, but the ring light and the glasses is just yeah. We're just here we go. There we go. Which mine is yours. Chico's women's size two, US 12, large paisley ruffle front, stretch elastic cuff, v neck top. This is what I'm talking about. These loud prints have been selling, ruffles have been selling, and paisley has been selling. This hits all of the marks. This is the trifecta <laughs> Chico's top. This top sold for $21.96 in all its glory. I'm telling y'all. Crazy. One dollar. So this was a bins pickup. Yes, that's the best bins pickup. If you can find Chico's at the bins, you can build a business off of it. If you cannot, you we pay three dollars and it's too much. So I'm just not I'm not as happy with the three dollar purchase price. You know what I'm saying? Yep, I hear you. Okay. Okay. Next is this. Next, yes. This is also Ben's. Man, I was excited to find this. Yeah, you were. J. Crew women's size 16 houndstooth pencil skirt confetti tweed wool blend stretch. And the reason I was happy to find this is because the J. Crew pencil skirts do very well. Houndstooth is trending again. It had some stretch in it. It was a size 16, which I very rarely find in J. Crew. All of these things led me to be really excited to buy this. The confetti mentioned is inside the print. There's, I don't know if you can even see it in the it's picture. It's really hard to see in the picture. There are little a like speckles. Colorful dots. We learned today in the live flex. Yes. F L E C K. <laughs> okay. All right, so next we have this uh, amazing Chico stuff. <laughs> I'm trying to build hype. Yeah, you, did, you did a great job. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. Women, Chico's women's size 3, US 16 extra large, black lace front top, bell sleeve, boho peasant, sold for 16 bucks on an offer. Yeah, we'll take it. I said lace front, but I should have said, like, tie front because this is – the kind of lacing that I meant, but it didn't translate well. This is a bell sleeve. I love the way this looks on the mannequin's arms. You can actually get a feel for what's going on there. And it's a really pretty shirt. I was kind of like taking a lot of offers this weekend because things were moving real slow. Keep this one. Nothing. What? Nothing. I was just waiting to see if it would uh, okay. Go over. Okay. All right. So hopefully you're learning about what Chico's can and cannot do for you. <laughs> All right. Next is another Chico's. <laughs> oh God, we're like the Chico's couple now. I don't, I don't know what to say. These are pull-on pants, but they have a print. <laughs> Can you tell I'm trying? These were also from the bins. There you dollar, go. Dollar cost of goods. Chico's women's size 2.5 P US 14 petite pant stretch pull on diamond tiny flaw. These have a flaw, y'all. There it is. Boom, 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 boom. I don't know what that is. I but I explained it <laughs> right here. What does this? Oh, I didn't explain it. <laughs> explained it in the description. What did I say? 
Is this the description? Whoa. What's that? That's a revision summary. I don't want that. I don't want that. Where's the description? Right there. Barely noticeable. Very. There's a very <laughs> pull on the front of the leg. <laughs> I'm sure that was supposed to say very small pull. <laughs> But it says very full. <laughs> oh, I'm trying so hard. So the accountability during live listening is great. But I have like supreme ADD, like supremo. Diagnosed. I'm not just saying this, okay? And so me trying to talk to people, teach people, and list things at the same time. Hey, sometimes you leave out of work. It's okay. <laughs> Got the point across. Stop that. Oh, so embarrassed. Um, so the buyer did pay six ninety nine for expedited shipping, but they're going literally just down the street to Dallas. Cool. So we're going to be fine shipping yeah. on the ground. Great. Um, our shipping is set up that way. They do not pick. Yeah, they don't priority choose the mail. They don't choose the service. They just choose says... expedited or standard, yeah. and then we choose how it's going to get there. And expedited, we're just saying, hey, hey, guy, it's going to get there within two or three days, and this will. Yeah. Great. Okay, we got a banger. All right. I got these at the thrift. Super, yeah. super stoked. First time I've found at the thrift. I knew about this brand because we got a bunch of it in an estate sale. And then I found these at the thrift. Look at these, man. That's great. These are the Nayot Women's Size 40 US 9 Papaki Sandals Taupe Pewter Nubuck Removable Soles. And they sold for $63.96. Nice. I think that's great. We paid three seventeen for these. That was our average cost of goods that day. Yep. Yep. I mean, they're cute, and they were in really great shape. Yeah, they look almost brand new. Dan took the soles out, so you could really see. This is what the brand is, Nayot. We've sold a ton of these, and it, they always perform really well. Mm-hmm. Never heard of them until we got them in that estate sale haul. Yeah, they're, it's an Israeli brand, I believe. And our friend Gretchen gave us a lot of info on them when we first got them, so that was helpful. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> I gotta do a switcheroo after this one. Okay. Okay, this is a Hustle Couple uh, favorite. Yeah, they have blogger favorites. This is a THC favorite. Yep. These are the Democracy Women's Plus Size 18W Skinny Jeans Faded Black Ab Technology Stretch. These sold for $15. How much do we pay? $317. These were in the $317 day. Anytime I can find Plus Size Democracy for a good price, meaning $3 or under, I will pick them up especially yeah like i said plus size especially because they the, they just aren't out there that much these are very low rise and um i think i noted that so 15 i, I like to get 20 for these and i always say you're not going to get rich off democracy jeans but they will flip so if you need like a high sell through rate thing to put in your to get the traffic going mm -hmm. democracy and judy blue always flip that's all i'm gonna tell you Truth. All right, I gotta do a little rearrangement over here. Okay. Do what you gotta do. So, we have one more Kari thing to add at the end. Yes, we had one, had another sale just come through. We will add that because we're trying to hit 50 today. I don't know that we're going to get to 50, but it would make me happy to get close to 50 things sold. Uh, the disclaimer I used earlier stands true for the next two things I'm going to show you. They are a bundle that sold. Yeah. And I don't know if it's a viewer or not. I don't know. I have not sold enough of this brand to know if it has a following. Did I mention that I don't know? <laughs> we just don't know, okay? <laughs> this is etc. We have a ton of this stuff. Yes, we do. This is all from the van. This is it's this is a cool top though. Etc. Women's size 12 top sleeveless perforated, perforated faux leather front zip back. I wonder if you can even see. Yeah, you can see it there. Look how cool this is when you zoom in. I love this feature of eBay that you can kind of zoom in and see. 
I'll show you. And the back was contrast with an exposed zip. And this is the brand tag. We have a ton of this stuff. A lot of it has not moved, but this did for $23.96. Sweet. And the second thing I want to show you is right here. Another et cetera in the same bundle. This is the et cetera women's size 12 animal print stretch pencil skirt gold side zip closure. So I'm just wondering. Was that a full zip too? I'm not even sure. Something's going on with the zipper there. It could have been clear in the photos. That's for sure. Yeah. Uh, and this also sold for twenty three ninety six, so I don't know. Don't go out and pick up all the etc. you ever find, <laughs> but if it keeps selling for us, then that's something to note. You gotta watch every day, guys. That's all I can tell you. Are you waiting? What was your plan here? I wanted to check it. So what is it? One four, one four. Uh, refresh the page. Recombine. I'm just thinking this is probably gonna be cheaper in an envelope. It might be. I just want this one. I wanted to check. But you sealed it up. <laughs> I'll just you know. Yeah. One four. Oh, what I do? What'd you do? Oh no, I may have closed them. Oh no, I did. Uh, I think we're okay. All right, yeah, it's true. <laughs> but even though it was ground advantage selected, but it's true. Right, but it's still they're gonna. We have enough shipping because they paid three ninety nine twice, right? Bundle. Yep. yep. Eight eight ninety eight. Yeah. Paid. <laughs> oh no. We've lost him. No. We haven't lost anything. You just get triple bagged if you get a bundle from us. Right. We love sending out extra. <laughs> Next. Uh, I, I've been saying this, and I hope that you guys have been hearing me. The Chico's dresses do better for us. You can get more money for them than the pants and the tops. This is a Chico's... Uh, this. Chico, size one, US eight, smocked dress, black, off the shoulder, stretch, knee, length, new, 33.71. It's sold for. All right, all new right. New tag, so it tells you exactly what you're working with here. If you're not sure this is smocking at the top, I'm going to go ahead and click on here and zoom in. This is really beautiful smocking, actually. Okay. So I think getting anything $30 and up is pretty good for Chico's. I mean, this is new tags, but it doesn't really, I don't really see a big difference yeah. between new tags and used in Chico's. Some brands, you know, new tags will go for double, not Chico's in my experience. And boy, do we have experience. <laughs> how did your life change? How did this, this happen? I don't know. We really don't know how this happened. Got nothing. I don't know what happened. The van happened. That's where, that's where all this stuff came from. I know. Okay, so we sold the etc. animal print skirt. And now I'm about to show you another animal print skirt hey. that we sold. Here's what I want to tell you. I think animal print skirts are trending. Or at least people are buying them from us because this is not the first and only and last. Also skirts in general. I know a lot of resellers don't look at skirts. They say skirts don't sell. I've heard it a million times. It's one of our best selling categories. Skirts, skirts are good to skirt. <laughs> and I'm telling you, it's it's good. So the next one is not a brand we pick up normally either. True that. This is not a skirt. That's not a skirt. It's a dress, it's a sheath dress. Do we sell another skirt from this brand? Um, I feel like I pulled a skirt of this. Never mind. It's not a skirt, but it's animal print. Anyway. No, no other skirts. That's okay. It's a lot of skirts. <laughs> Sorry, this is a dress. 
this address. You get what I said. But still, Animal Print's moving for us like crazy. This is Jones, New York. Signature stretch, size 14, Animal Print, sheep dress, rear zip. I'm going to show you this. This is the example that I keep talking about of putting things on a mannequin. A dress form is great. If you have that, fine. But this, with hips and a butt, I'm telling you. Come on now. I've also been telling you, I think sheath dresses are in for a minute. This is a sheath dress. It goes in at the waist. It's animal print. It's classic. Who doesn't want to look like that at work? Hello. Look at that. Mm. <laughs> I think she looks so great. Uh, I would encourage you, if you are mannequin shopping, Jones New York Signature, uh, I would encourage you to get a mannequin with curves. They make them. Not necessarily, it doesn't have to be plus size. It just has to have curves. So it looks like a real person. Right. Some of the mannequins out there are like super, super tiny. I'm a tiny person, but like curvy, right? There's curves, but some of them are like, eat, 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 like all the way down. <laughs> <laughs> and that doesn't help your clothes at all, right? I would wait for the right one to come along. Yeah. <laughs> like dating advice. <laughs> Okay. I'm so excited that we're still selling white stuff. Because sometimes, remember back in the day when they, no white after Labor Day. <laughs> that doesn't, we don't do that anymore. Uh, more tiny, flawed stuff going out the door. All right, all right. These are Chico's pants. I know you're shocked. Chico's women's size 1.5, ankle, US 10, white pull-on pants, stretch elastic, tiny flaw. We will show you how we note the tiny flaw. If my computer will like the logo, that would be great. What's happening? I don't know. I going real slow. There it is. There's a tiny little bit of something. See? Mm -hmm. We try to get in there and really, really show what you're about to get. And these are 1.5 short. I put 1.5 ankle. No, ankle. Okay, cool. Cool. And these sold for fifteen dollars, and we bought them for three. Three bucks. Not great, but they're white pants, so I was more likely. Hold on, I want to have a conversation. I was more likely to take the offer since it's at the end of the season, and I don't want to hold on to those white pants. Right. Until next year, so fifteen dollars in my hand. Fifteen bucks, little man. I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> Who's, well. single, who's singing Jungle Love in their head right now? Oh, yeah. man. Hey, hey, buddy. Hey. You're failing. Hey. hey. What was hey, that? Man. That was a failure. I'm sorry. All right. Another Lafayette 148. I love this top so much. I thought it was really pretty. How much do we have into this? You're failing at that. 359 There we go. Winner. This is Gingham. Uh, Lafayette 148, women's size, small, boxy top, gray gingham, buttons down the back. Hey. Cotton, I'm sorry. Hold on. <laughs> Did you hear me? Did you hear me? Buttons down the back, y'all. Okay. All right. I'm, I'm going back to it. So I can show <laughs> Had to cut in. This is gingham. It's okay. It's, I turned like <laughs> That's the pattern. The boxy, when it kind of looks like a rectangle or a square, that's kind of boxy. Look at those buttons on the back. Yeah. Look for those details. When you're swiping through those racks at the thrift, look at the backs of those things because it doesn't, for me, I don't think the brand matters at this style. Lafayette 148. That's a newer label. I believe that I purchased this online. Really? I think I did. Okay. And I think I bought it for myself, and it didn't fit. <laughs> oh, dang! Uh, it says we have three fifty nine into it. I think that's probably five dollars, which is what I paid. I'll fix that. Okay. Okay. All right. Bundle. Bundle. Is this a viewer? I don't know. Thank you. Thanks. I don't know. We never know. Okay, one of them is a little person. Mm. I've been taking these down like crazy, but luckily they got it before I got to it. Um, Chico, size one, US eight, pullover top, flutter sleeve, black short sleeve, new with tags. Come okay. on. 
and a Fisher Price uh, Cinderella. Yeah, you heard me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's right. This little Cinderella, is so cute. Mm -hmm. We haven't been listing these individually anymore. I'm going to do a lot of them. So that is the little Cinderella Fisher Price four twenty eight, and the Chico's sold for twenty three seventy two, and that is this. Look how beautiful this is! The flutter sleeve, ruffles, all the things we've been talking about. Chico's really does have it going on. I'm pretty impressed. And okay, again, okay. newest tags. Little person sandwich. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> You feel <laughs> Sorry. Poor choice of words. <laughs> All right. We have two more things in a new bundle. Again, don't know if it's a viewer. Very sorry. Another bundle? Next. Okay. Both are the of these are Lafayette 148. That's another thing we've been shouting from the rooftops. This brand is having a moment. Yeah, man, it's moving this is, for us. This is going to be heavy. Yeah. We need a flat rate. All right, here's the bundle. The first thing is this shirt. I believe I got this at the bins. Where? 659, 349. Mm, then I got it at the thrift. But look how beautiful this shirt is. This is called a sateen uh, cotton. It has a shiny look to it, but it's feels like cotton. It's a really, really nice shirt. So the title here, if you're just listening, Lafayette 148, women's size 10, button front top, magenta, long sleeve, 100% silk. I lied to you. This is silk. <laughs> if it looks like this and it's cotton, it's a sateen. But really, I think I have two of these shirts then, because this is the one I was thinking was from the bins. It's possible, yeah. Uh, that sold for $38. Sweet. Gosh, I keep getting things wrong today. I'm so sorry, you guys. Yeah, this is silk. There's the tag. This is the a different shirt that I was thinking of. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. I have another one like this that's cotton. Anyway, and then the also. Uh, there's someone missing. We did sell that dog. Oh, we did sell that dog. Oh, why is the jacket missing? <laughs> Dang it! Yeah, it's not up. Okay, well, you're just gonna have to take my word for the next one. The next one is the Lafayette 148 New York Women's Size 12 Bronze Jacket, Polyester Metallic, No Belt. The outerwear from Lafayette can go for really high prices. But this didn't have the belt, and it sold for 30 which I still think is pretty good. Dan is shoving this. I don't know if this is going to work. That's why I said I think you need a padded. <laughs> you know, the padded told more. I'm just going to try. Yeah, he, he gave it a valiant effort. So you already saw, spoiler alert, that we <laughs> sold a plush. We don't have many plush listed. Uh, somebody asked when we're going to list the brain. I challenge you to list the brain. Okay. So our plush is now stored with our inventory. We just put it right in the box. <laughs> Yeah, it works. Put it in the bag, right in the box. Go get an assist. Yep. Thank you. This is a schnauzer, I think. <laughs> this this is, it is a schnauzer. <clears throat> okay, so I'll leave you to, to okay. that. Thank you. Here's the schnauz. This is Rustberry. Yeah, Rustberry. Toby. Oh, yeah, it's Toby. It's Toby. We've sold a lot of Tobys. <laughs> Why do we know this? I don't know. We're running. We still do love selling plush. We just haven't found any really good plush in a while, besides the brain. And besides that other one that I found that I need to clean still. We've just been more, more uh, selective. Toby says it right on the tag. Thirteen fifty six. Okay, come on, Toby. Going, going on a little trip. Okay. Oh, 
oh, this one looks so good on the mannequin. <laughs> you can tape Toby's tag on there. There you go. This one does look good on the mannequin. It looks real good. This is Chico's. Look at this thing. Yes. Um, Chico's Traveler, size one, US eight, medium, black open cardigan jacket, front pocket, slinky. And I just think this looks way better. It looks nice. I don't know why the computer is like flipping flopping like this. Look at that. Come on now. I want to wear this. <laughs> it's like a. Why is it doing that? What is it doing? It's just like flashing. Oh. Anyway, here's the Chico's Travelers logo. And how much do we pay for this? Um, $3.59. $3.59, which means it came from the van. Yep. Dan's using a Tyvek for this because yes. it's going to Texas. Yep. And the, yeah. And the, and the priority mail rate at this weight is $7.20. So we're going to save 40 cents. What's the ground advantage rate? Is it $7.15. Interesting. So we're paying the extra five. Yeah. Because, yeah, yeah, whatever. Yeah. I'm just, yeah. I like to know about this stuff. Yep. So you write the machine directly. Right. Next came in our haul from Linda. This is a new Atag's PacSun sweatshirt. And I used to work at PacSun. Fun fact. There you <laughs> go. This is Guns and Roses. This is the, I don't know, but it's kind of cool because it's a hoodie, but it has short sleeves. <laughs> I thought that was neat. That was kind of neat. Um, this sold for $25. Pretty quickly. Yep. I'm mad about it. Doesn't want to go. I like how you give it free will. <laughs> it doesn't want to. <laughs> Okay. Next are a pair of jeans that we've had approximately forever. So I don't know that I would recommend these. Yeah. But they sold. Them. Yeah, super cheap though. Only 70 cents paid. These are Hudson women's size 27 denim jean pants. I put the style number. I don't do that anymore. Distress Y2K low rise. Um, I find that the Hudson's without the flaps on the back pockets mm -hmm. do better because your cell phone, as a woman, you know, we ain't have pockets. So as soon as you put a flap on the back, no matter how Y2K it is, it's not usable for your phone. Uh -huh. What you're going to do, put it in your front pocket? Here's the logo. Okay. Okay. Guess what's next? Is it Chico's pants? It is Chico's pants. Okay. <laughs> right. Yeah. I was joking. It really is. <laughs> no, there it is. Hey. Wait, quick flash. Here's the uh, Lafayette 148 jacket. That's old. It's a little trenchy. It's kind of yeah, cool. Pretty sweet. It would look better with a belt, but it's still cool. Yeah. I still would buy that again, even without the belt. Is it these? It is those. Chico's. Wait, can you guys see this? Yeah. Chico's. Women's. Size one. US eight. Medium. Black pants. Stretch. Pull on straight. Slinky. Is that black? Yeah. yeah okay. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, these sold for $20.01. Oh, the Hudson sold for $19. I don't think I told you. Oh, 
There you go. Okay, in the same vein as Travelers, J. Jill has the wherever pants. Wherever. And they do really well, just like the Travelers. They're pull on pants. These are a maroon. J. Jill, wherever. Women's size large petite, slim leg pants, stretch pull on. And uh, I'll show you the tag. We still do most of our pants just flatly. Wherever collection, it says it right there on the tag. And you can see the ribs, very, very similar to Travelers. Yeah. In fact, I get them confused at Thrift when I feel them. So these were, cost was $349. And they sold for $20. There's a lot of numbers happening here. 9832. <laughs> Lord. <laughs> All right, next is one of the things like sell what you know. <laughs> and Dan had this. I did. I did. First run Skeeter. Dang on first run Skeeter. Okay, but I'm going to throw you under the bus right quick. Why? Because your listing was real bad. Was it real bad? And then you didn't even have any, nothing. So I had to go research it and then I relisted it and put like details. Sometimes you just be like, ships first class. <laughs> and it has all these specifics for this. So I had to get the weight and all that. It has all this stuff. Yeah, it was like all up in here. Okay grams or something yeah, i don't know 172 I i'm telling you let me just see what i did to this listing because then it finally sold pretty quickly <laughs> yeah man this is disc golf if you're not knowing what we're talking about yeah first run skeeter that's right and it was one of the drop downs was skeeter well that's the yeah. <laughs> i'm telling you i didn't know i photo roomed all your things okay whatever i appreciate it i know the disc golf dx skeeter first run black stamp 172 g yep all that boom boom and look at all these specifics they had for it i was so excited okay it's so for... like getting big again like, well it was never like big when i was buying it but it's like getting oh, more, really? it's getting more mainstream for sure it sold for 22 dollars you see things like that at thrift maybe look them up i don't know but you got to do your due diligence in listing. Yes. So We've I, had that listing for like, I'm, I'm throwing you into the bushes as an example. I know. When we were baby resellers, that's how, that's how we did things. You know? So. Next, we have, I know you're shocked. <laughs> This is actually not Chico's pants. These are loft pants. Hey, close enough though. Uh, these are mine. Okay. Teach your pants. No, I bought them at Thrift. Ann Taylor loft, women's size, extra, extra small, petite, pull on pants, crop knit, navy blue, wide leg. I know you're not going to believe me, but they're too big. <laughs> so, <laughs> uh, this size does sell. In fact, of all the loft things, I would get plus size and extra, extra small petites all day long. Yeah. Because it's hard for us people to find. These are like gaucho pants. Uh, they were just a little bit too big for me. And they, I don't know, what do we have into these? Maybe they, nothing. 99 cents. 99 cents. Says. Yeah, because they were from the bins. Yep. Um, these sold for twenty three ninety six. I think that's really good. That is really good. And what is happening here? Right, it's Texas. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, I can I can switch it. <laughs> For but how much? Like, yeah, right. so like a dollar fifty difference. Wait, I need it. Uh, there, I need to make a ticket for that. Yeah. That's the the frisbee. Oh, I know what it is. Oh yeah. Okay, we're gonna crumble here in the. <laughs> Hey, we went on. I want to say thank you to all of our Dallas friends. We went out with some local resellers yesterday for coffee and we went thrifting. It was super fun. Yes, it was. Thank you guys so much for going with us and for Ashley for arranging it. It was great. Sure. 
good times. I, I've never met any resellers near us, really. All right. There we go. Next. This thing you're going to have to figure out. This is a very large packaging. Yes, it is. This is going to our friend Maggie. Hey, Thank you so thanks. much. She's just dying to hear us say Chico's one more time. Yes. Here you go. Chico's women's size two US 12 large cardigan, red ruffle front, belted chunky knit. She's hitting all the, the trends. All of them at one time. She said she didn't wear this to work. Love that for you. Here it is. This thing is nice. It is real nice. It's actually very chunky. But there's the ruffle front. It does come with the belt. Look, the sometimes photo room crops out the mannequin's leg and they just leave it. You get the idea. I don't have time to be, you know, making things. Look at that. Look at that silhouette. Bam! You see what I'm saying? That's why you need a curvy one. Look at that. I love it. And here's the tag. And here's the measurement. He's fitting it. Oh, you guys got to see this. Somebody's going to be like, cut a hole in the bottom. No. <laughs> he does not like to do that. All right, I got to check and see if we sold anything else while we've been on here. Just that Mercari, I think. Okay. I like to check. Oh, no. Look at I like that Poshmark tells you people decline such things. Appreciate you. Got it. I see that. <laughs> now eBay's holding steady at 30. So we had 30 on eBay, six on Wait, Posh, let me, and. Let me get this last one, Kari. Three on eBay, I think. Ship the item, this guy. Right, I can't fit you. You have to go here. Let me get the Macari. Oh, the, what's the uh, what's the SKU number on the Macari guy? It is 3747. 3747. This is a soft surroundings. Uh, Cardigan, I don't have this pulled up, so forgive me, but it's sold it, for twenty five bucks. Okay, and it looks it's we paid five ninety nine for it. It looks like Missoni. I would bet this was Missoni from far away. Oh, totally. Yeah. I'll show you. It is new at tags. It looks just like Missoni. I don't know why we had this so long. This thing is awesome. And it does have a tie front. It's really pretty. Okay, you're gonna have to Dan fold that. Okay. All right, now I gotta do a switcheroo again. And you wrote it on. Oh, you printed it on the new one. I just printed the new one, yeah. Oh, it says 31 parcels. My eBay says 30. Okay, so this is a flat rate envelope, the animal print? Yes. It is 31, I don't know why. He's blown. I know. He answers my friend of blowing in the wind. Okay, so I'm putting the third I'm putting the third Mercari where it should be at the end of okay. the other Mercari's. So we got to forty one, I think. Okay. All right. I'll take that. Yeah. I was trying to get to fifty. I was trying everything. <laughs> Did not work, but valiant effort. Righty.
Do you want me to read them to you? Uh, yeah, if you were able to. Yeah, just give me a Gotta. Oh, my goodness. <sighs> I gotta shuffle. Oh. Ready? Almost. Ready. Okay, uh, two pounds. Uh huh. 11, 3, 13. Okay. 11 ounces. Okay. Flat rate envelope. Flat rate envelope. Check. Seven ounces. Seven ounces. Flat rate envelope. Flat rate envelope. 13 ounces. 13 ounces. Wait a minute. I thought it was calling. I'll call me right back. Okay. What are you on, Chico's? We're on Chico's. To ten, Texas? To Texas. 10 ounces. Okay. 14. Okay. 11. Yep. 15. 15. Padded flat rate. Padded. Mm -hmm. Okay. Flat rate envelope. Okay. Flat rate envelope. Yep. Flat rate envelope. Check. Flat rate envelope. Check. Flat rate envelope. Check. Six ounces. Yep. Eight ounces. Eight ounces. Padded flat rate envelope. Flat rate. Padded. Nine ounces. Nine ounces. Priority. Yep. One pound four ounces. Okay. Uh, padded flat rate envelope. Flat rate. Padded envelope. Okay. Flat rate. Yep. Flat rate. Yep. Flat rate. Yep. Eight ounces. Okay. Flat rate. Yep. And padded. Where's the car coming? Huh? Isn't the car supposed to come? I gotta call them. Or... Mm. Yeah, I don't know what's happening. Okay. First up, the sport belt, 4389. One oh six oh five. One oh six six eight. One two six one. One oh five five seven. One oh one two six. One zero zero five two. Eight one zero eight. One oh one six nine. Uh, one zero zero eight seven. One zero zero seven three. One oh one oh five.
bundle. With eight zero three zero. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, it's fine. Nine one seven eight. Nine three five five. One oh four eight four. Nine six five three. Chico's and Little Person. Lafayette Bundle. Nine five one four. Yeah, the dog. The dog. <laughs> you like eggs? You like eggs? Nine six one two. Oh, dogs! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Somebody got a Tommy Boy reference the other day. Mad yeah. props. <laughs> one zero oh, three eight zero. Nine Sometimes they're obvious. Sometimes they're subtle. You know. Five nine six zero. Nine nine zero one. Can we just have an eighty weekend? I just want to sell eighty things <laughs> again. It was the best weekend ever. Nine eight three two. That was an insane Monday. That's what that was. And uh, that was our best video too. Yep. Our best performing video. I shouldn't say. It was a dumpster. <laughs> yes. Your hand is. Backwards. Nine five four six. All right, and Maggie is up last, but certainly not least. Thank Little six two six. Yeah, I'm having an issue. Oh no! Thank you. Thank you. There it is. All right, you guys stick around for just another minute and we'll be back to talk profit numbers for all this stuff. Picnic, what are you doing? Really? <laughs> yeah, you ready? Jeremy's already walking. Meh. Meh. Yeah, we're just going to say hi to the people today. I'll get you your treats in a second. Look at this pretty boy. Jeremy. Picnic, say hi to your friends, and then we got to go. Okay. All right. Bye. <laughs> hi. Hey, everybody. All right, I put in all the stuff. I'm excited. I don't even have it pulled up. I don't even know what I'm doing. Okay, now I do. Alright. Uh, eh. It's a, it's a eat. I mean, it's not where we want to be for a full weekend of sales. Goal, yeah. Goal wise for us. This gap for me is yep. killing me. This it's... means our cost of goods is too high and our fees are too high. Um, a lot of that is because we increase promotions. Anyway, six hundred and thirty-nine dollars is not bad for. It's basically two days, but now with Monday, it's three days. Um, and if we look at our month today over here, it is. We're still up from last month. Last month we ended at fifty-four hundred. Yeah. So we're up from that. Okay. Okay. Here's what I was thinking. What were you thinking? So when we sell the Chico stuff, it's like picking up ten-dollar bills. Mm -hmm. Because we're making almost about ten dollars between nine and fifteen dollars profit on most Chico stuff. So you're like picking up a ten dollar bill. 
I'd much be rather picking up twenty dollar bills or fifty dollar bills. Sure, me too. Or hundred dollar bills. Yep. So it takes a lot of bending down and picking up to get enough ten dollar bills to make a hundred dollar bill. <sighs> Uh, uh, yeah. Can you guys tell I'm a teacher? These analogies just come real natural to me. <laughs> but it helps me visualize it and think about it. So I'm like, well, if I have to bend down 10 times instead of just bending down one time and getting 100. However, there are a few $100 bills. There are fewer $50 bills. There are fewer $20. There's a million $1 bills, millions, millions, millions like Scrooge McDuck size, right? In ten In $5 bills, there's even, you know, okay, a bunch. $10 bills, not bad. It's not bad. It's so not. you've been down 10 times. With a dollar bill, you got to bend down 100 times to pick it up. All of this is free money, though. That's where we... <laughs> it's free money. It's free. Like, we're doing a little bit of work, but basically we're turning something... I mean, nothing into something. Right. The problem comes when there's nothing to turn into anything, right? And that's where a lot of people fail. Because you stop... Once something's got to give. So right now we're selling tons of tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of Chico so we can pick up $10 bills. Cha-ching, 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 cha-ching. We want to be selling the Eileen Fishers, the newer Lafayettes, the, that kind of stuff where other people maybe want to sell blogger favorites or anything else is going to get them $100. Some people like sneakerheads, like to sell that and then get, pick up the $50 bills, pick up the $100 bills. So if your sales are slow, you got to choose one. And if you don't have access to that inventory, like we don't, Yet, yep, you got to get a lot of ten dollar bills. It's better than five, though. It is better than five. No, but seriously, no, you're right. I you're was right. thinking, like, we could be selling Target and Walmart stuff, and maybe cha chinging five dollar bills or having yard sales and cha chinging one dollar bills. Yep, but we're getting tens. I'm, I'm happy with my tens at the moment. And those tens have added Ten. up, <laughs> those ten dollar bills have added up to six thousand four hundred dollars for us this month, right. Which that's is, not bad. Which is not bad. No, it's not. It's not bad. That's not bad. All right. So that's I'm just I'm just thinking out loud, you know? Put it in perspective. <laughs> good. Go pick up some. Perspective is good. When in doubt, zoom out. Ah. All right. Well, I think we're gonna see it tomorrow. We're gonna see it tomorrow. All right. Thanks for hanging out, guys. We'll see you back here tomorrow. Bye. Bye.